All right, I want to give you guys a quick little overview of vector illustration in Flash. And uh, I've got the square tool right here. I don't have an outline around it. So when you see me draw this uh, this rectangle on stage, it's not going to have a, another color surrounding it. It's just going to be this blue color. Hey, look at that pretty blue. All right. Uh, if I go over here to the black selection arrow, all right, click on that. Uh, you can see that I'm, uh, when I hover over the corners of this, the, uh, the mouse icon has a little right angle next to it. Now if I'm uh, between the, the corners of it, it's showing me this uh, curved line. So what that means is I can just bend the line like that. If I'm hovering over one of the corners, which is actually, even though you're not seeing it, it's got, it, that's where your vector points are, right? So that right angle is telling me that, hey, you know what, you're at, you are not really at a corner, you're at a vector point, all right? And so you can see that regardless of whether or not those are right angles. You still get the little right angle icon on the side of the uh, the mouse. But uh, so yeah, it's just showing you that you have found a vector point, and you can see those a little bit uh, more clearly, obviously, if you have the white selection arrow. But just as a preference, uh, I I tend not to go with that. All right. Um, if you're if you're coming from an Adobe Illustrator background, you might really prefer to to see the uh, the vector points. But I don't know. I guess it's just something I, I find them distracting. You know, I, I kind of like to you know see the um, see the object without the points distracting me while I'm working. All right. And um, if you would like to create another vector point in here on the uh, the Mac, you can hold down the Apple key, and uh, on the PC, you can hold down the Control key while you just click drag out from any side of the shape and then you can just kind of do whatever you want creating more points moving them around and that is really just one of the key things that I wanted to, te to teach you guys uh, in this uh, this lesson so that's a kind of enough to, to get you started playing around and then uh, we'll uh, we'll cover some of the the real tools in the uh, the videos to come